what's going on everybody this is island hopper tv hotels coming to you from the sheraton grand here at the londoner you see there's the footbridge going across to the venetian and we got paris over there it's like a mini europe here in china macau actually studio city all of its grandeur over there. I'm gonna show you the room, show you the pool. It's a bit hazy today, unfortunately, so it's not gonna be the most colorfully blue sky out of the pool. But off to the right is the reception. It's a very busy hotel. Next level up from here is going to be the Londoner shops. And then on level three, they have the food court, but this is the reception. You can see, always very busy, always. Even the bell service. I've yet to see this not with a line. Then again, it is around two o'clock p.m. Still, I think that says something about the check-in process or how many rooms they have here. I'm not sure what that says exactly. They have the Feast Restaurant over here. And then this is the Pacifica Casino. Can't film in there, though. Sands Rewards check-in. They do have a Marriott Bonvoy Elite check-in, which is right here. A little bit of a less line. Still a line nonetheless. Yeah, I'm just amazed at the lines here. It's quite amazing how many lines. Hello. This here is the fourth floor. This is actually where the swimming pool and the fitness center is located. So we're going to go to the swimming pool right over here. It's a bit of a hazy day here in Macau. Get a cabana there. Looks like they've got another pool over here, or is this a jacuzzi pool? Oh, they do have a jacuzzi. And lots of saxophone music. Okay. Looks like they have a bar here. Now we'll go down to the fitness center. Hello. I'm just looking. Yes, thank you. So there was no fitness center video allowed to be taken. So I'm going to the swimming pool sala. I think this is two sides to the swimming pool here. Hello, how are you? I'm just looking. Ah, yeah, yeah, please. Thank you, hello. I think this might be the kids' pool, I'm not sure.
big pool, big pool area. Okay, that's good. And this here is level three, Shine Spa. Hmm. Okay, so I was just at the spa, it's not where the sauna is. The sauna is back up there on the fourth floor. This is the Paisa Club. Hello, where's the food court? Here's a look at the room. This one also has a tub. Let me show you what's in here. Then you do have a view, Studio City and Paris. There's the pool. Well, the Londoner is an interesting complex with many different hotels, I will say that. I've stayed at the St. Regis, the Sheraton, not the Conrad yet. I might do that later. All right, now for my final review of the Sheraton here in Macau. I would say the location is around a five. It's a very good location right here at the Londoner. Easy to get across the footbridge to go across Kotai Strip if you wanted to. Also close enough to MGM and the City of Dreams. Next, I would talk about customer service. I would say about a five. It's pretty good customer service, no real complaints there. The room quality was about a 4.5. I've definitely had better rooms. Uh, I could have been better for a Sheraton Grand Hotel, but it was still a nice room and good views looking over at the Parisian. The other thing that I would say is the check-in process was one area where I was a bit frustrated and I could see some other people getting frustrated with the lines. Now, I'm a Marriott Bonvoy, so I was able to get a little bit ahead of the uh, check-in process, but if you're average uh, Marriott Bonvoy or just a regular person trying to check in, expect long check-in lines, and that really is a problem. So if they fix that, it's a great hotel um, to stay at, definitely recommend it and I would give it about a 4.5, and if it's under $300 a night, it's worth it. Anything above that, I'm not so sure. See you guys on the next one from The Parisian. If you enjoyed this video, please consider watching our video from The Parisian next, or the St. Regis right here in Macau. See you on the next one. Thank you to all our subscribers.